This episode of Ad is brought to you by GoToAssist Express. Learn more at gotoassist.com slash butterscotch. You know, buying a TV once upon a time was about plasma or LCD, and now there's all these different technologies, including LED TVs. You know, I wanted to check with Frank Lee here at LG to find out exactly, let's demystify some of these terms, because I think people are really confused. And you know, all the television companies are trying to market their different approaches. Right. And I, I'm, I'm getting more confused than ever. So let's talk about some of the buzzwords that, that are going on right, right now. Right. So, uh, so first of all, LCD versus plasma, two different technologies. Yep. yep. And what about this LED tele tech TV thing? Well, LED is actually a, a subcategory of an LCD because an LCD uh, generates its picture through a backlight behind the screen. Right. And all we've done with LEDs, instead of using uh, CCFL, which is like a fluorescent tube that you right. see in your an office or in the basement yeah. of your home, replace it with LED bulbs. Oh. And that's the only difference. So the technology of the TV hasn't changed much, it's just how you light up the back of it. Well, so LED isn't a different kind of television, it's just a new type of LCD. Exactly, that's what uh, it is. Okay. So why are we getting confused? There's, there's a lot of noise in the marketplace, I think. Right. All right, good. So other buzzwords that people may run into? Well, you're going to come across uh, local dimming. Local dimming, yeah. okay. So an edge lighting. So okay. there's two ways to approach uh, LCD or LED televisions. Yeah. And edge lighting is where you have the light source for the backlighting uh, on the top or bottom or the sides to, to, to create the image behind the screen. Right. Um, the other way to approach it, um, unfortunately, that approach has some challenges in that it may not give you the intensity or, or uniformity as you'd like to see. So it's so, just going to be uneven, perhaps? Right, there's been a lot of this. Now, there's a lot, of, a, a, a lot of innovation to really make sure that that intensity is as equal in the center of the screen as it is on the edges. Right. But to take it to one step further, manufacturers have introduced local dimming. And what you've done now is you've taken the screen and you divided up the screen into sectors or blocks and then you infuse them with LED uh, sources. So now it's, you can do local dimming. So for example, like a, a film like uh, Nightmare Before Christmas or Sin City or the director's cut of Blade Runner, a lot of dark scenes where it's gonna be challenged to be able to produce a true black. What now with local dimming is that regions of the screen could actually dim or shut off to give you that black color that you're looking for. Very good, okay, cool, okay, I get that now. Now, uh, anything else that we should know about? Well, right now, the, the next thing you're going to hear about is, okay, there's local dimming. So there's edge lighting, there's local dimming, and then there's full array. And full <laughs> array, yeah. what happens there is you have the entire back panel yeah. is completely covered uh, and powered by LED bulbs, right. not just in regions. Okay. So um, for LG, you have edge lighting, you have uh, local dimming, where you have uh, uh, 16 regions. But on our, our top of the line series, you have 240 uh, packages of LED bulbs, which gives you precision control and that greater accuracy of color reproduction. Right. And then let's just talk very briefly about 3D. There's been a lot of talk about 3D television right, right now. Yeah. So that's yet another category, because I'm guessing that the 3D technology isn't, is it plasma or, or LCD, or is it? Well, 3D can be applied to both plasma and LCD. Right. Um, of course, over the holidays, lots of excitement with Avatar. Yeah. And there's a lot of questions. If that film was released later, maybe the buzz may not be as intense right now as it is right now. And you know what we're seeing is with 3D, it's about that experience. Television is about experience. And there's two ways to approach it, active or passive. Okay. And with passive, what you're going to see on the screen is that double image. So back in the day with those red and red, yeah, the red and blue, blue or yeah, red. back in the theaters, that's the same thing. You're going to see two images being presented, yeah. and the and the lenses are just polarized, so that now you're going to see two, a left and right, and in the brain they've come together, and now you have that sense of depth and motion. So, that, so the glasses these days are, are polarized, meaning like sunglasses, I guess, right? Right, yeah. exactly. So in this sense, the advantage here is uh, the cost of those passive glasses are very affordable. We're yeah. looking at probably two, a dollar to two dollars in cost right. to produce these. Uh, on the other side, you have active. Active 3D, okay. Active 3D, and what happens there is there's only a single image being produced on the screen, yeah. but the lenses are called shutter lenses, and they actually communicate, whether Bluetooth or infrared, with the television, and they shut left, right off, and it happens so quickly that you can't actually see it physically happen, and that creates a left, right 
thereby creating stereoscopic vision. Right. Amazing stuff. All right. Frankly, with LG, thanks for demystifying uh, uh, televisions for us this year. Uh, for more coverage, check out our website at photoscotch.com. Hey there, Andy here. Sean here. Andrew here. And we're in Las Vegas at CES 2010. I want to tell you about a brand new product called GoToAssist Express from Citrix Online. At Butterscotch, we're in the business of helping people solve their computer problems. And GoToAssist Express is a fantastic tool for offering remote support to your clients, your colleagues, or even your grandma. Grandma! It'll save you time and money, and it'll make you look like a hero to boot. So finally, a remote support solution that's easy and affordable. And it's fun! So try GoToAssist Express right now, free for 30 days. For this special offer, you must go to gotoassist.com slash butterscotch. That's gotoassist.com slash butterscotch for a free trial.